Welcome back friends this is Ram here and it's 20th tutorial on Java FX 8. In this tutorial we are going to see how to save date into a database that is relation between date picker and database. So let's start with first of all I am going to create a new column for the date. So go to the your SQLite manager and in the database go to the structure so, and add a new column say I'm going to add date of birth and that say type text and add a column say ok so it will add a new column I have added a date of birth and so this is the new field to add a date into the database so now let's start with the program I will rename the title it's 20 tutorial on date picker and database so to add the date into the database I am going to add a new field date picker say date into the class tutorial so now fix the import for a date picker so it will add an import for a date picker so this is the import now next I am going to add the date picker field into the second scene so date for the we have declared a variable date is equals to new date picker next I'm going to set the prompt text for a date so date dot set prompt text and say date of birth so I am going to add date of birth of the user next set the maximum width so date set max width 300 so save this now add this date to the second scene so I am going to add this date to the fields that is the date save this and now check whether the date field is added or not I'm using the previous username and password that is Ram Ram and so this is the date picker added so it will be like it, it is default editable so now I'm going to set the font of the or increase the font of the date picker so to do that I'm going to set style I'm going to apply a CSS so fx say font size and 
say it is 20 now save this and now I'm going to add one more field in the insert into database field so such that we can add our date of birth field so we have declared a DOB field in database that is DOB so I'm going to add this date into the DOB and add one more value next I'm going to add one more set so set string say parameter index 7 and now to add the date I'm going to say text field a date so date is the type of text field and get from editor so get editor and then dot get text so using this we will add the date into the database so next is I'm going to clear the field so after adding the date so to do that say date dot set value say null so after saving the date into the database it will automatically clear the date now save this and run once again and I'm using initial username and password so ram and ram and login so here you can observe the the font size of the date picker is increased and we have applied a CSS for that now I'm going to add one more user with the date so say user id 5 say first name Rahul say last name Sharma say next email id so Rahul Sharma at the rate gmail.com next set username say I will say Rahul username and password also Rahul and I will set the date of birth of Rahul so go to your date picker and see I'm going to set some say Fifth July, so twenty fifth July nineteen ninety, and save. So the user has been created, and okay. So this is the field has been cleared because of we have set the value to null. Now we are going to check whether these fields are saved in our database or not so in the database click on show all so this is the new user we have created with the date of birth so this is the tutorial 20 and if you have any question about this tutorial ask me in a comment section or you can mail me on my email id alapureram at the red gmail.com 
and finally if you really like my work please like share and subscribe to my channel thanks for watching this video and see you in the next tutorial